We're here to help you learn and play with the planets, stars, and constellations in your sky. I'm so excited! From here on Earth, all the stars in the sky may look tiny, but up close, they're about as big as our sun! Pegasus. Pegasus means winged horse. To find Pegasus, look for the great square of Pegasus. Four stars of equal brightness making a square shape right near Cygnus the Swan. Pegasus has a bright asterism. That's a group of stars in a constellation that form simple shapes. This asterism is known as the Square of Pegasus. Can you see it? It's shaped like a square. Pegasus. Sagittarius Sagittarius means the archer The arrow of Sagittarius points towards the star of Antares, the heart of the scorpion, in Scorpius. Sagittarius contains an asterism. That's a group of stars inside a constellation that forms simple shapes. It's known as the teapot. Can you find a teapot? Create your drawing for this constellation! Sagittarius is a centaur. That means he's half man, half horse. People say Sagittarius's bow and arrow point towards Aries, the lamb with the golden wool. Saturn. Saturn is the sixth planet from the sun. Saturn is the second biggest planet. Over 750 Earths could fit inside Saturn. Saturn has 62 known moons of all different shapes and sizes. The largest is called Titan. Saturn is the... I am a space explorer. Ophiuchus, Mars. Mars is the fourth planet from the sun. The red planet Mars is the second smallest planet. It's about half the size of our Earth. Mars has two very small moons, Phobos and Deimos. They are small and lumpy, like potatoes. Mars. Scorpius. Scorpius is another way to say scorpion. And Teres, the brightest star in Scorpius, is also called the heart of the scorpion. Sometimes people confuse this star with Mars because they are both colored red-orange.
Scorpius was known to ancient Babylonians over 3,000 years ago. Indus Pavo To Canada. Create your drawing for this constellation. <laughs> A kid's place is exploring space. Canis Major. Canis Major means big dog. Canis Major is easy to find. He is running along behind Orion the hunter. Good dog. Canis Major contains the brightest star in the sky, Sirius. It's also known as the Dog Star. It is one of the closest stars to Earth. Well, close compared to other stars. It's still 50 trillion miles away. Canis Major means Big Dog. Jupiter. Leo. the lion would scoop up people and no one could stop him but one day Hercules went to wrestle the lion and he won everyone the lion had captured was set free Leo means lion Leo is one of the easiest constellations to spot in the night sky. Look for a backwards question mark which forms the lion's head and chest. Can you find it? Leo is a very old constellation. It was created almost 2,000 years ago. Jupiter Cancer The constellation Cancer represents a crab. One day, Hercules was wrestling a huge monster. A crab tried to stop him. Hercules defeated the monster and kicked the crab away, all the way into the sky. Cancer means the crab. Cancer the crab lies between Gemini the twins and Leo the lion. Cancer looks like an upside down Y. It's very faint and hard to see. Ursa Major ah! 
Ursa Major means larger bear. Within Ursa Major is a group of seven stars that are called the Big Dipper. They make up the backside and tail of the bear. Can you find them? Ursa Major has an asterism. That's a group of stars inside a constellation that forms simple shapes. This asterism is called the Big Dipper. It makes up his backside and tail. Can you find it? Create your drawing for this constellation. Ursa Major means the Great Bear. Many years ago, a girl named Callisto was transformed into a bear. Zeus saved Callisto by placing her up in the sky where she was safe. Earth is the third planet from the sun. Earth is the fifth largest planet. Earth has one moon. The moon orbits around Earth about every 27 days, which is about one Earth month. Let's play hide and seek in space! to swipe and move around the sky or tap the compass to switch modes. This planet is a gas giant! Use your finger to swipe and move around the sky or tap the compass to switch modes. Jupiter! in Jupiter's atmosphere is a storm two or three times the size of your planet Earth. Well done, Space Explorer! You're a... Solar Sleuth! This spot is super tricky! Look for me in a constellation shaped like a woolly animal. This constellation's Latin name means sheep or ram. Aries! Aries is often said to be the sheep from the story of the Golden Fleece, which is one of the oldest stories in the world. Well done, Space Explorer! You're a... Cosmic Collector! Come and find me! The constellation I'm hiding in is one of the largest constellations in the sky! Centaurus! Centaurus contains Omega Centauri, which is not one star, but a huge cluster of them. It contains more than 10 million stars! Well done, Space Explorer! You're a... Uh, Excelsior Explorer! Come and find me! If you can find this constellation's belt, you can find me! Orion! Well done, Space Explorer! You're a... Galactic Guide! hiding in a constellation that has wings. Try again! This constellation is a swan. Cygnus! 
Deneb, the swan's tail, is one of the brightest stars in the sky. Well done, space explorer. You're a stellar searchologist. Jet to mission control. I'm hiding in the constellation that's right next to the giant scorpion. Sagittarius! Of all the constellations in the sky, Sagittarius contains the most known planets. Well done, Space Explorer! You're a star seeker! Come and find me! I'm near Ursa Major, but I'm pretty minor. <laughs> That's not where I am. There are two constellations. Ursa Minor! Well done, Space Explorer! You're a Deep Space Discoverer! Jet to Mission Control! The constellation I'm hiding in is known for its big pincers. Cancer! Cancer is not a very bright constellation, so it's pretty hard to see. Well done, Space Explorer! You're a Ace Astronomer! Come and find me! The name of this constellation means Water Carrier. Aquarius! Aquarius might be a big constellation, but it's also a dim one, which means it's only visible when it's very dark out. Well done! You've earned a badge! You're a interstellar investigator! This little spot is super tricky. The constellation I'm hiding in contains the brightest star in our sky. Canis Major. You can always find Canis Major if you can find Sirius, the brightest star in your sky. Great work! You found me! Let's play hide and seek again! Exploring <laughs> space. Let's play hide and seek in space!